Hard to imagine anything good coming out of the tragedy at the Indiana State Fair. Seven people lost their lives, dozens injured after a stage rigging collapsed August 13th. But on Monday, good morning. 17-year-old Brad Humphrey gets a special reception from friends and faculty at Crispus Attucks High School. It's his first day back to class since the stage collapse left him paralyzed. I'm excited about it. Do you think this will help you heal from all of this? How mm -hmm. so, then? In a lot of different ways, just being around friends and stuff. Oh, it's a very, very good thing. We'd worried about him so. Brad's absence has tested his friends, students, and staff here at Crispus Attucks in ways they've never experienced, leaving them feeling much like a hallway does during class time, empty. The place is not really itself without him. You can tell, like, there's been a difference since he's not been there, especially since our senior class is so small. Everybody knows everybody, and we're like a family. But when tragedy struck, his family of friends pulled together. What's helped? Just my friends, they came and visit me in the hospital and stuff. Friends say he's already returned the favor. What I take away from this is just to never give up at anything. He didn't give up, even though it's been like a rough road, he never gave up. You just got to keep a positive attitude. You can't give up. You have to keep going no matter how hard it is. Inspirational words from a high school senior. Paralyzed by tragedy, but with every intention of moving forward.